Hey guys, I'm Greg. Welcome to Greg's Beer Reviews. Let's go see what's in the fridge today. Alright guys, thanks for stopping by Greg's Beer Review today. Today's beer is Terrapin Sunray Wheat Beer. It is a, uh, it is a summer type beer. It is, uh, uh, it is a Hefeweizen coming in at 4.50 ABV. The, uh, the beer company Terrapin Beer is out of Athens, Georgia. So uh, they have a pretty big distribution area. So, uh, most of their beers are, are usually above average. They do a lot of uh, a lot of extreme beers too, uh, which they call side projects and stuff. And some of those beers turn into uh, some of their regular offerings. So uh, they do a wide range of beers. Uh, the food pairings for this cuisine is German, of course. So the cheeses would be your tangy cheeses, your feta cheeses, uh, the brick, the the general the food pairing for this. They say salad, but. I'm not much on salad with the beer. It's just that's just my opinion, though. Uh, the meat would be poultry fish and shellfish. The beer is not recommended for extended salarings. And once again, uh, they put the date on the bottle here where it's Best Buy, and that's a thumbs up to me. That lets everybody know how old the beer is and when you should drink it and all that. So, that being said, let's get the cap off of it. See what we got. The glassware today is the Wheezing glass. That's what they recommend. So, let's pour it in there and see what we get. That pours a straw amber, not quite amber, it's basically a straw colored, pours about, oh, not, not quite a full finger of head, a uh, lot of carbonation in there. You can see the bubbles just screaming up from the glass there. So, uh, looks pretty good in the glass. Looks real good. Very appealing or appetizing. So, let's get a nose on it and see what we have. All right, this is a uh, this is a Hefeweizen, so it's going to have the Belgian style yeast. Uh, you get the pineapple, the banana, the cloves, uh, all your standard Hefeweizen smells. Uh, well, it smells pretty appealing. This is a what I, you know, I like to refer as lawnmower beers. Uh, these are great on a hot summer day. Uh, uh, it's a lot better than drinking a macro lager. So let's see what it tastes like. You get the banana and the cloves, a little bit of the wheat. Very, very crisp and refreshing. Very, very pleasant. Nice. If you're out on a hot day and you need something to cool yourself down, this would be a good go-to beer to to drink. Uh, not too strong on the ABV, it's only 4.5, so you can drink a few of these and not worry about getting in trouble, especially if you were at home anyway. So I'm going to sip on this, and uh, we'll be back shortly, and uh, we'll do the final chug and tell you what my final thoughts and grades are. Stick around. All right, guys, thanks for sticking around. Got just a little left in the glass here. I've been sipping on it about 20 minutes or so. Well, that's a really sweet, pleasant beer. Very easy drinking beer. As it warms up, you can I can taste the honey. They get some honey from the uh, Savannah Bee Company, so uh, that's a Tupelo honey that they add to it. So it's a it's a right tasty beer. It's uh, it's got all everything that you want in a half of ice. And so that being said, uh, I'm gonna do the final chug and tell you what I what I think of it. Great. Very nice. This is a 
this is definitely an above average beer. To me it is. So. It's got the tartness, it's got the banana, it's got the clove, it's got the honey. Very easy drinking. Low ABV at 4.50%. So, got the date on the bottle when it's best by. So, if you've seen this, pick it up, give it a try. It's at the end of the season, so it's almost out of date. You might not be able to find this till they do it again next year, but uh, if you see it, pick it up, give it a try. I think you might like it. I'm going to give this beer an 8 on the scale from 1 to 10 tonight. Uh, if you've had it, let me know. Give me a comment back uh, and let me know what you think of it. Guys, always rate, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next beer review. Cheers.